no wax. What's up, man? It's your boy, Chief. Listen, man, protein can really help you lose weight, have a lot of benefits, and we're going to talk about all the benefits it has today. One major benefit that protein has is help with those late night cravings and just cravings overall. Protein helps you feel more full, it helps with that appetite, it helps you feel more satisfied. So just by consuming more protein, that's going to entirely help you lose weight because you're going to cut back on those cravings, and that's tip number one. Another major benefit for consuming protein is also helps with muscle size. The more protein you consume, the more muscles you can potentially grow. Yes, you have to go to the gym to send signals to your body for your muscles to grow, but ultimately by increasing your protein and working out, that's gonna increase your muscle mass, which is gonna help you burn more weight. It's easier for me to burn more weight because my body naturally has more muscle versus like the fat. Muscle weighs more than fat, so typically I burn more calories just by having the more muscle mass. So the more protein, the more muscle, the better. So that's another benefit of increasing your protein intake. A third benefit of increasing your protein intake is also increasing your muscle mass, which is gonna help with that belly fat. And by getting rid of belly fat, that's gonna help because belly fat surrounds those organs and we don't want a lot of belly fat around our organs. So we really wanna make sure that we're building muscle. So by increasing our protein, that's gonna help increase more muscle, which is also gonna help burn that belly fat, which is gonna help overall with our digestive system and also getting rid of the belly fat around our organs. So that's one major tip. And also this helps you keep the weight off by building this muscle, by increasing your protein and building this muscle, it's gonna help you keep the weight off. Another major benefit to increasing your protein is the longevity of your life. As we get older, we lose muscle muscle each and every year. So in order to build muscle, we need to increase our protein. Just by increasing our protein and cutting back on those carbs and our fats and our macronutrients, that's gonna help us stay lean and build as much muscle as possible because remember, every year we get older, we're losing more and more muscle. So it's important to build up enough muscle by the time we get to our 60s, 70s, 80s. So if we're not eating protein, if we're not consuming protein in our early 20s, then that's gonna set us up on the back end because we're not gonna have a lot of muscle once, we, once our body starts to break down. That's why you see so many people have injuries and things of that nature, and it's really hard for them to walk as they start to age. So protein really can help with also aging and help with that elderly age of you know being able to walk and being able to pick yourself up going up and down steps. That's another benefit. And lastly, another benefit to increase your protein intake, it helps your body recover. If you're having shoulder pain, back pain, neck pain, or even muscle pain, anything like that, you need protein to help you recover. Carbs only give you energy, but by increasing your protein intake, that's gonna help your muscles, that's gonna help your body recover overall. So just by increasing the amount of protein you're consuming, that'll help you with recovering. Hey, listen, man, don't forget to subscribe to the page, hit the notification button, and check out more content. So to answer your question, overall, yes, protein does help to lose weight, and it's actually very necessary. A lot of people are not consuming enough protein. You need at least one gram of protein per lean body weight, not your overall body weight. So if you weigh 200 pounds and 170 of those pounds of straight muscle, you need at least 170 grams of protein or a little bit more if you're really in the gym. So it's very important to pay attention to your protein intake. Oftentimes when you're going out to these fast food places, they're giving you a bunch of rice, they're giving you a whole, a lot of carbs, a lot of fats, and they're giving you a little bit of protein. It needs to be the other way around. So I really recommend you guys focus on consuming more protein. I know it can be quite expensive, but it can be very beneficial. So please make sure you're upping your protein intake. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to the page, hit the notification button for future content coming out, and so that way you'll be notified of every video I put out. Stay tuned, content performance, we out. Let's go. No wax, no diamonds, no wax.